Slam and Warped Wing Brewing are teaming up to offer a great beer dinner next week. That Friday night won't be bad weather, right? The Golden Lamb's executive chef Josh House is here with Nick Bowman from Warped Wing for a preview of the event. Good to see you guys. Thanks for having Congratulations us. Congratulations on a year of success. Thank up you in very Dayton. much. Yeah, with Thank Warped you. Wing. So, Josh, why don't you start us out? Tell me okay, why uh, why the Golden Lamb decided to put this together next Friday night. You know, the <clears throat> obviously, the Golden Lamb's been around since 1803, mm -hmm. and you know we often strive to to use as many local products, especially beer ones. Craft beer is obviously very popular. Yeah. Warp Wing is a great brewery that we've paired with before, and we wanted to come back and do it again with them, uh, you know, after their one-year anniversary. So you're doing a cured salmon on the menu and we a whole are. bunch of other really good stuff. Yeah, right? we are. And uh, we had a chance to sit down and taste some beers last week, and the Hop Smuggler, which is new, pairs really well with this cured salmon dish. Okay. So I'm going to kind of kind of show you how we get started here. Yeah. Should start with a little piece of salmon, a uh, little equal mix of salt, uh, sugar, and a little bit of coriander. So is cured salmon not cooked? It's just it's not like cooked, this. it's just okay. cured. Traditionally, it was uh, cured to help you last through the seasons when you couldn't get the products. Oh, okay. um, so we're just doing it not so much as a preservation technique, but more as a flavoring technique. All right, very good. So we've pre-cured this salmon uh, only for about between an hour and four hours, depending mm -hmm. on the size. And then we're going to go ahead and slice some pieces here. All right, uh, while you start slicing, I want to talk to Nick for just a second Absolutely. about the beers. This hop uh, beer you made just for Cincinnati, right, Nick? We did. Um, it, we're in the middle of Cincinnati Beer Week. Right. And, um, you know, we just launched the Cincinnati market a few months ago, mm -hmm. and they've been very welcoming to us for being from Dayton. So we wanted to do something special. Uh, the beer is called Hop Smuggler, um, and it uh, the story behind the beer is it dates back to 1829 really? when the Miami Canal connected Dayton and Cincinnati together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and legend has it there was a group of smugglers that used to smuggle hops and beer and barley and ingredients. We had a little That's fun with really it. Neat. But um, yeah, now you got your name because you like to warp flavors together. I was reading, right? Yes, yeah, we That's um, cool. we like to do um, our own proprietary beer styles, and then we take you know current styles and put our own little twist on them. Okay, so uh, what's this one? This is pirogue. Uh, this is a Belgian style black triple with coffee. Ooh. Uh, it was a local collaboration with a local uh, coffee roaster in Dayton. Woodboro, yeah. and we came out with this last year. Uh, it was very well received, and so we um, we just relaunched it uh, a few weeks ago. Very good, Josh. How can people get signed up for the dinner at the Golden Lamb uh, next you week? Know, the easiest way is to call the restaurant. You okay. can uh, get on golden uh, www.goldenlamb.com to check out things? the menu. Oh yeah, absolutely. Okay, so we'll put a link to the Golden Lamb on the website. I only have about 20 seconds okay. left. What are you putting on top of the? All right, so salmon? we put some pink peppercorn, some jalapeno. Um, we're going to put a little black salt just for crunch. Mm -hmm. We're also going to add a couple sprigs of cilantro here. And then we're just going to finish it with a real little drizzle of olive oil. All right. So next Friday night is the dinner. We have the information on the website along with the recipe. And if you're up in the Dayton area, go see Nick and the folks up at Warped Wing Brewery. Thank you both so much. Thank you. Have fun.